Welcome to Webstyle Plus. What is the difference between a dialog and a popover in HTML? Dialog element can be a modal or non-modal dialog box or interactive component such as a dismissible alert. A popover attribute in HTML makes an element a popover element. In simple words, both are pop-ups but with few differences. This is dialog in HTML. Dialog tag. It's HTML tag. It needs JavaScript to open and close. It can be opened with show Moodle method and it can be closed with close method. It makes the rest of the page inert. You cannot interact with other elements when dialog is opened. If you click outside dialog, it will not close. So it does not support light dismiss behavior. You can style its open state with the open attribute. It semantically represents an interactive component that blocks interaction with the rest of the page. Semantically means it is according to HTML standards and best practices. So it is understood by browsers and assistive technologies. But popover is an attribute, not a tag. This is popover. It's an attribute. Here it's values auto. It can be auto or manual. Popover does not need JavaScript, although it can use JavaScript if need be. It can be opened with a declarative invoker such as popover target. An attribute can show it. Popover target and then ID of this div with attribute popover. This will show this div when we click at this button. This is popover. And it can be closed with popover target action equals hide. Popover value can be auto or manual. Auto will support light dismiss behavior, such as this. Clicking outside will dismiss it. But in the case of dialog, it's not the case. You'll have to click this button to close it in case of dialog. But popover will be closed if you click outside it. If here values auto, if it's manual, then it will need action. Click of this button to close it. It does not make the rest of the page nerd. You can interact with other elements on the page when it's open. As you can see, I have selected this. It supports light dismiss behavior. If you click outside, it will go away. If you click escape, it will go away. You can style the open state with the popover dash open pseudo class. Popover attribute does not provide semantics on its own. You will have to make it follow best practices and make it compatible across devices yourself. Popover and dialog both have backdrops. So this is the comparison between these two. So do you need popover when dialog already exists? I will say you might not, but in few cases when you need a light dismiss behavior and non-blocking pop-up, then you may need it. Maybe for drop down menus, sidebar menus, etc. But what do you think? Let me know in comments. Okay, I hope it helped. Like, share, subscribe and I will see you in the next one.